Would you rather send your kids to school in person or continue distance learning? Which one are you going to do? Send them back to school. Yeah. Right. In person? No hesitation? <laughs> Parents at Round Lake Park and Eden Prairie were pretty like-minded. Their kids, too. Do you want to do distance learning in the fall or do you want to go back to school? School because, I mean, it's easier, more fun, and you get to hang out with friends again. But there are parents hesitant to bring their kids to an outdoor park, let alone send them back to an indoor class in the fall because of the coronavirus. Yes, I want my kids to go to school. Yes, they need to go to school. But we need to find a safe way to send them to school. State officials are asking all Minnesota schools to prepare three plans. One for sending all students back to school, one for continuing distance learning, and one a hybrid model, which could mean half the students are in one day, half the next. Deputy Commissioner of Education Heather Mueller says they'll give final guidance by July 27th, but schools have to be flexible. So it really is more of a fluid and, and approach to a school, a district, a county, uh, a community, um, and that's going to be based on the guidance and feedback from the Department of Health. Shout out to all the teachers out there for sure, uh, but please take my children. <laughs> Love you guys. <laughs> the health department was asked today, why not decide now? Why wait until late July to make a decision? And their answer was their decision might be different a month from now, depending on the data, just like their decision might have been different if they had to make it a month ago. And remember, all schools have to be ready to implement any of the three plans at any time. Back to you. Well, you can see in the poll an overwhelming majority of you say you will send your kids back to school this fall. We should also note that the Department of Health wants to hear from you too on this topic. We have a link to the state survey with this story on care11.com. Another downward trend today in coronavirus cases in Minnesota. There were 300